What I want to do today is connect our Twitter and Notion apps so that whenever a new tweet is sent out to our Twitter account, a database item will automatically be uploaded into Notion. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial so you can try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap by clicking the button on the left-hand side of the screen. Because I want Twitter to trigger a message in Notion, I'll need to use Twitter as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click My Tweet as my event and then click Continue. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Twitter sees that I've created a new tweet, it's going to run this workflow. The first time we set up Twitter, we'll need to authenticate it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Twitter account. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryption when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to Zapier's security and trust page in the description as well. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click Test Trigger. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our action. Type in Notion into the search bar and select it on the drop-down menu. Next, click Create Database Item and click Continue. From there, I can select our account and authenticate Notion with Zapier, just like I did with my Twitter account. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue and it's time to assign our Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps fields. Under Database, select the database you would like to use for your Zap. I'm going to click Tweets. Once your database is selected, your Notion database columns will appear. Under Name of Account, I'll select Usernames, and under Tweet, I'll select Text on the dropdown and click Continue. Click Test Action, and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, whenever we post a new tweet on our Twitter account, a database item will automatically be created in our Notion app. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier could do so much more with these two apps and thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.